Hello today's video we have the following content. A dark horse has emerged in the ancient puppet world. Can Zhang Han successfully remove the oil this time? 1. A plot full of pleasure. The charm of the theme of time travel lies in the fact that the protagonist is very powerful, grasps the truth of the matter, never suffers losses, and is mainly refreshing. Liu Guangyun accurately grasps this point. At the beginning, the heroine who traveled through time and space avenges the original host, which arouses the audience's blood boiling. Han Ziking, played by Zhu Zudin, opened her eyes and found herself lying on the street in dishevel, attracting a crowd of onlookers. In fact, she is the daughter of the Han family's main wife. In order to choose a concubine, she was designed to be violated in a restaurant to destroy her reputation and prevent her from participating in the competition. Before crossing, she was a mercenary with strong martial arts and a very irritable personality. After learning that she had become Han Ziking, she made a big fuss in the Han family. First, she kicked over the eldest lady who bullied her and tore off her clothes. Then, she quarreled with her father at the door of the Han mansion and slapped the daughter of the Han family. This series of operations made the audience very happy and applauded. Although Han Ziking avenged the original host, the eldest daughter of the Han family did not want her to participate in the selection of concubines and set up obstacles everywhere. In this regard, Han Ziking naturally would not give in. She insisted on participating in the selection of concubines, even if her reputation was damaged. Anyway, she didn't care, but was happy to watch the excitement on the spot. In the end, Han Ziking was inexplicably favored by the fourth prince, played by Zhang Han, and the eldest daughter of the Han family designated by the emperor really lost face this time. Although it feels good, the plot is still maintained. Han Ziking actually just wanted to observe and did not intend to really marry the fourth prince. But who knew that at this time, she noticed the dagger on the waist of the fourth prince. The dagger is an important prop for crossing. In order to get it, Han Ziking can only adopt a delaying strategy and agree to the pursuit of the fourth prince. This made the eldest daughter of the Han family lose face instantly, and the plot is simply satisfying to the audience. Since Han Ziking was not the princess chosen by the emperor for the fourth prince, the emperor put the fourth prince under house arrest, and Han Ziking became a thorn in the eyes of the palace. In order to deal with her, the princess set up a Hongmen banquet to invite Han Ziking, and secretly gave her acupuncture, hoping to force her to kneel down obediently. In addition, a deadly poison was put into the tea, intending to kill Han Ziking within seven days. Han Ziking is a mercenary in modern times, and easy tricks can't deceive her at all. After learning about the princess's conspiracy, Han Ziking cleverly counterattacked. When the princess sent someone to visit, she pretended to be seriously ill and vomited blood on the other party's face, which not only made the other party lose face, but also further consolidated her image of being seriously ill, which can be said to kill two birds with one stone. This kind of Black Lotus character who will take revenge is really charming. 2. Surprising cast. To be honest, every time I see Zhang Han's name on the list of leading actors, I will be shocked. After all, his previous image in costume dramas was either too greasy or too enchanting, which did make the audience retreat. In the past two years, his reputation has continued to decline, making it difficult to imagine what excellent works he can perform. However, after watching two episodes, my opinion of him has completely changed. This time, he plays the fourth prince, who is not only outstanding in martial arts, but also delicate in thinking and a little cunning. Zhang Han interprets the nobility and free and easy nature of the prince vividly, especially in the scene of selecting concubines, he ignores the eyes of others and favors the disqualified Han Ziking, with a playful and firm look in his eyes. This kind of character that is both domineering and not too artificial is undoubtedly tailor-made for Zhang Han. Speaking of Zhu Zudin, she has participated in many costume dramas in the past, but it is always difficult to leave an impression. However, in this drama, she always maintains a bitter face, showing a cold temperament, which makes the audience feel distant. The performance of this role was mastered by Zuzu inappropriately. Although the two have not yet had a deep relationship in the current plot, the confrontation in a fight scene is eye-catching. The fight between them is evenly matched, and the audience's heartbeat accelerates. I believe that as the plot develops, they will definitely show a different spark. At present, the market competition for costume dramas is very fierce, and revenge dramas like Liu Guangyin are also emerging in an endless stream, such as Mo Yu Yun Jian has received some attention. Compared with other similar works, the biggest highlight of Liu Guangyin is that the heroine's martial arts value is extremely outstanding, which undoubtedly enhances the audience's viewing experience.
The heroines in other works often rely on the rescue of the hero, while the heroine in Liu Guangyin can not only save herself, but also protect the hero, which has improved the novelty a lot. Next news. Liu Guangyin Hanwei Love. Liu Guangyin is a costume fantasy love drama, adapted from Mao Ziaomeo's novel Poison Pet Mercenary Princess, directed by Chang Yuanhui, and starred by Zhang Han and Zhu Zudan. The plot tells the story of Han Ziking, played by Zhu Zudan, a concubine of the Xiang Fu, who intersected with the Shining God of War Jun Biao, played by Zhang Han, because of a change in identity, and was forced to be involved in the disputes surrounded by powerful countries and foreign races. In the process of uncovering the mystery of their life experience, Han Ziking and Jun Biao embarked on an adventure together, fighting wits and courage with various hidden powerful forces on the Long Giran continent, and explored many secret areas of the continent that ordinary people could not reach. After going through hardships and tests, the two finally solved the mystery of their life experience, killed all kinds of evil poisons, and protected the peace of the Long Giran continent, and their love finally became a couple. In the play, Han Ziking was originally a weak concubine, but because of an accident, she gained special power and became strong and brave. Her relationship with Jun Biao gradually changed from mutual use to deep trust and love. The plot not only contains thrilling adventures and battle scenes, but also touching love stories and in-depth discussions on personal growth and self-discovery. The Flowing Might has attracted a large number of viewers with its unique subject matter, tense plot and wonderful performances of the actors. This series is not only a visual feast, but also an emotionally rich story, which brings the audience an unforgettable viewing experience. Thank you for watching the video, please leave your opinion in the comments section. Don't forget to press the channel subscription button. If this is the first time you watch a video on the channel, 